I am checking in from the Evolo Hotel in Melbourne. I'm in the centre of the city. It is beautiful. It is 6.44 a.m. here. I've just been for a run with Zana. Those of you that know me know that I don't get up before eight and I don't run, but new city. I'm trying new things out. I'm so excited because today we have a full day of exploring. We are starting with breakfast at Matcha Milk Bar. Then we have a guided tour of the secret locations of the city. Then we're going for lunch. Basically, we're eating our way around. So I thought I'd bring you with me, show you all the best spots that we find for vegan food. And I literally cannot wait to shove my face in it. <laughs> So, alrighty, walk you through it. Here we have the blue algae smurf latte, apple pie, herb peanut butter, cacao, charcoal, beetroot, and matcha. Oh, oh my man. goodness.
we've had lunch, we went for a walk on the beach, we had a dance on the beach, and what and happened? Then I jumped onto Steph, I mounted her, and in the process, she dropped her beloved rings into the sand and we spent freaking 15 minutes digging for them, didn't we? Yes, I'll show you the moment where we dropped them now. on a side road in the middle of Melbourne mm -hmm. we're gonna find somewhere to just chill have a snack have a coffee before the meetup whoop 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 meet up meet up meet up meet up meet up meet up whoop whoop meet up whoop whoop meet up whoop 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 meet up wave woo yay celebratory dance celebratory dance celebratory dance was amazing. That was insane. How incredible. We can't get over the fact that that many people came to see us the other side of the world. It is like when I sat and thought about it, I was just like, what is life? That How is many so people surreal. do you think were there? About 50. Yeah, like coming and going and like everyone was so friendly and smiley and positive and everybody's chatting to each other, everybody's making friends. Yeah, and people that were from England realised that other people were from the same area as them and like bonding over it and there was people who went to my uni, there's like three people who went to my uni who yeah. all like met each other and I was like no way! And then there was just Australian people that were so nice, mm. so nice, weren't they? Like so, so nice. It was amazing. Yeah. I'm buzzing. Oh, I'm buzzing, and my face hurts from smiling so much. But now we are celebrating and going for dinner, vegan, greasy junk food. That is exactly what I want right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In and around my mouth. My mouth. It's a place called <laughs> Lord of the Fries. So we've seen loads of them around town, haven't we? Yeah, they're like apparently the vegan version of McDonald's. Which I'm cool with that, so let's go and get into a food coma. Let's yes. eat! Yes! Oh my god. We got sweet potato fries with a mountain of mayo. I obviously got ketchup too. And then fake chicken nuggets with barbecue sauce and an Oreo milkshake. Out of 10, how excited are you? 11. Yeah. <laughs> Try a chip. Okay. No, don't. Don't. I'm gonna get emotional. <laughs> so good. <laughs> I have a feeling we're being watched. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not joking when I say today has been one of the best days of my life. From everything from the meetup to exploring the city to seeing the artwork, the architecture, the energy, the smiley people, the sun, just everything I loved about Melbourne. I think. I mean, if I say it now, then I'm going to have to do it. That I'm going to move back next year, January, February time, just for two months, literally just to explore and adventure even more because I have honestly fallen in love. It's just somewhere that I could see myself living, somewhere that I think has a great energy and I could be creative here, you know? I've got a bubble in my throat. It's gone. I hope you've enjoyed watching my day as much as I've enjoyed experiencing it. And if you have, give it a big thumbs up and continue to watch my Australian continue to watch my Australian adventures by clicking subscribe because I'll be doing a few more vlogs whilst I'm out here. I'm honestly having the best time ever. I don't want to come home and it's only like halfway through the first week. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe.